Erasmus programme is a fantastic opportunity to be able to actually study within Europe. It differs from many of the other sort of wider study abroad programmes throughout the world simply because it's, there's a financial contribution that can be made on a national scale so all students that would like to participate and who are eligible can receive some finance. We've got a number of universities that we have Erasmus agreements with and we have to make sure that every student is briefed properly about how their degree combination makes them suitable to which university, the courses that they can do within that university and the length of time they can spend there. At the beginning of the second year I will actually run a programme that encourages students to join. So I'll do some talks, I'll arrange meetings. Uh, one of the key ways of doing it is to actually get last year students to come back and talk to our students about going next year and that makes a huge amount of difference. I just think it's good to do as many things that are slightly different to what you're normally doing as possible for the experience in your life so that you learn things from it because you're going to learn more things than just doing the same thing every day. So I just wanted to go and no, I wasn't really nervous at all. I studied in a French business school so I was expected to take classes in um, things like marketing but they were in French. There was only two of us on the on the whole of the 130 people in our course that actually did the Erasmus, so I think we were seen as quite, you know, being quite sort of bold. Well, the Erasmus experience is definitely highly recommended. It's a cultural experience more than an academic one. You do get to improve your language skills. You don't even have to speak the language before you go there. A lot of people that I've met during my Erasmus year just came because they wanted the Erasmus experience. I first went straight to my um, uh, Erasmus coordinator, who uh, she then told me where I could go to, uh, where I could go in the Erasmus scheme. Um, once I found that out, I also went to the study abroad office, and they were really helpful. Tell you about accommodation, um, also the Erasmus grant, which is really good because you get nearly a thousand pounds just to go abroad. Usually we've got a system of students getting in touch at regular intervals or else we send out emails or they've got different mechanisms like a report or something like that that they send in halfway through the year. Um, any student who's got major personal problems of any variety at all is definitely encouraged to get in touch with us and we will normally act on that very quickly. Uh, we give them advice about what they're supposed to do with their passports, health, insurance. Uh, we organised their enrolment at the Italian University. We had a committee that organised social events, took us on days out and trips to other countries and also around the Netherlands. I was very much welcomed when I was in Belgium. Like There were so many activities for Erasmus students, um, like welcoming parties and things like that. When I was studying in Dijon, I didn't spend any more money than if I'd been just here. So I wasn't in any kind of financial problems at all, it was exactly the same because of the support I got. I didn't have that many problems actually because um, the Erasmus Social Network that was based in Belgium, they, commun they contacted me in the first place, they, they asked me what kind of room I wanted, how much I was willing to pay, they, they even met me at the station when I arrived, they had my mobile phone number, they were there when I met my landlord and so actually, and they gave all the information I needed so actually um, the fear comes from a lack of knowledge and as soon as you have that knowledge the fear goes away and the Erasmus year is just full of fun. Artistically, I was able to go to so many art galleries. Um, the actual art school arranged trips that were subsidised. So I was able to go, I think I went to Switzerland to about five amazing galleries in Switzerland for four euros. And that included the coach there and back and entrance to all the galleries. So like four euros for that is incredible. You just, you meet so many people. You obviously do your studying you're of management in French, which is great to put on the CV. You, especially when you pass all, all, pass all your exams, you do all these presentations. 
Um, it's a good experience and it's good, a, a good way to see how another university works, especially I was in a management school over there, so that was a good mix. I mean, everybody who goes on Erasmus has no doubts about the value of it. Um, all the Italians who've been here um, uh, are just unanimous in the enormous value of it, and all our students who come back from having spent a year in Italy are once again unanimous about the value of it. They generally say it's the best year of my life so far. So there's no doubt about that. I really feel invincible. I feel like there's nothing I can't do because I've, I've managed to make friends with people around the world, I've experienced all sorts of amazing things that I otherwise wouldn't have experienced. My language skills improved immensely. I think that's the main thing that I learned. That was the most important thing that I picked up as well. Um, just how to use it in everyday life and things like that. And also, um, I mean, it just shows how much I'd learned at uni that I could put into practice as well. Well, the funding you get compared to the loan you get, you know, normally when you stay in the UK, the funding is fantastic. You can pretty much do as you like when you like because travel is so cheap. Living, you know, just living is so cheap. Rent, you know, £120 a month in Augsburg compared to £330 a month in Reading in my second year. You just and then that was, of course, without this extra funding from the government, which is unbelievable, the, you know, the amount of spare money you have. Yeah, I can say I've made friends who are going to be friends for life now and just had an absolutely brilliant year, travelled everywhere and saw so many things that I, I just wouldn't have seen or experienced if I'd stayed at home and not, not done that. I would advise everyone who is thinking about going to the Erasmus program to go and not be afraid, be open-minded and um, sociable as well. Um, but what I really want to say is be, be confident, just go for it. Don't, don't worry if you make mistakes, just speak as much of the language as you can. If someone was going to do it, I would really encourage them. Um, what they'll learn from it is amazing. They, they will learn so much uh, language skills, um, they'll meet so many new people, and it's just an experience of living abroad as well. Just go for it, definitely. It'll be one of the best experiences of your life, and you'll make so many new friends.